In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to turn your camera off and on in Microsoft Teams. Whether you're working from home or attending a virtual meeting, knowing how to control your camera can be incredibly useful. Let's walk through this process step by step. First, you'll need to sign into Microsoft Teams. If you're not already signed in, open your browser and navigate to Teams. You'll typically find this under the Microsoft 365 suite. Once you're there, click the sign in button. If you have multiple accounts, make sure you're using the right one associated with your work or group to avoid any issues. Now that we're signed in, let's find that all important video icon. This icon is usually located at the top right of your screen or within the main menu bar in your Teams interface. It might look like a small image of a video camera. Clicking this will take you to a section where you can start a meeting or join an existing one. This is where you'll be able to control your camera settings. Next, let's delve into starting a meeting. In Teams, you can either start a meeting from scratch or join one that's already in progress. To start a new meeting, look for the Start Meeting button. It could be labelled slightly differently depending on the version you're using, but the option to initiate a meeting should be prominently displayed on your screen. Click on this button and you'll be asked to set a few initial meeting options, such as naming your meeting or inviting participants. Now let's move on to controlling your camera. With your meeting window open, you should see another video camera icon. This will be in your toolbar, often at the bottom of your screen next to other icons for muting and chat. Clicking this icon toggles your camera on and off. If your camera is currently on, click the icon to turn it off. You'll notice that the icon changes slightly, often to a camera with a slash through it indicating that your camera is now turned off. This helps conserve bandwidth and can ensure privacy when you need it. To turn your camera back on, simply click the same video camera icon again. You'll see the camera icon revert to its normal state, confirming that your camera is active and broadcasting to your meeting participants. These steps should give you confidence in controlling your video settings during any Microsoft Teams meeting. Remember, keeping your camera off when it's not necessary can help with your internet speed and improve meeting focus and privacy. And just like that, you're all set. Whether in a professional setting or something a bit more casual, you'll know how to navigate your camera settings with ease. If you have any questions or need further clarification, feel free to reach out. Thank you for watching and I hope you find these instructions valuable in your daily virtual interactions.